Welcome to DIY Design by CCW, DIY Design for the 21st Century. My name is Candy and I'm the host of this channel. Now let's get into this video. Well, hello everyone. Welcome to DIY Design by CCW. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day and I thank you so much for watching this video. Guys, today I am doing another tablescape collaboration. Uh, this one is the St. Patrick's Day Tablescape uh, 20. So it's St. Patrick's Day Tablescape 20. Uh, you will find the other participants' videos under the hashtag the luck of the Irish 20. Now, I want to start off before I get into my typical walkthrough, talk through of everything I did and what's on the table. I want to give a shout out to the host of this collaboration. Uh, her channel is If It Ain't Cheap, I'm Not Buying It. Now, I love that. I love that. That is a great title. If, I, if it ain't cheap, I'm not buying it. Now, I will make sure to leave a link uh, to her channel in the description box uh, and, and all the other information like the hashtag, etc. And as soon as it's available, I will also make sure uh, that the playlist is added to the description box. Now, what were we to do today? So the colors we were to use was green and white and gold. Uh, we were given a choice of having a four leaf clover and or a leprechaun on our table and some sort of food or drink and that food had to be green or that drink had to be green. So um, those are the rules. And uh, what I'm gonna do now is my typical walk through, talk through so that I can uh, show you what I did. So first thing I did is put white linen tablecloth uh, over my uh, glass table. Because again, this, this theme is white and gold and green or white and green and gold. Um, and then for my place settings, what I did, and I'll just get a little close here. Most everything here I already had. The only thing that I purchased was these green plates, and uh, I got those from Dollar Tree. Um, so what I did is, again, I layered the, put the uh, white tablecloth on the table, and then I used these gold uh, table, <clears throat> excuse me, gold chargers that I already had, gold placemats that I already had, put my green uh, Dollar Tree uh, plate on top and then this is a green and white or rather a gold and white saucer that I already had and um, then in the middle <clears throat> I picked up some uh, four leaf clovers and I uh, got those from the Dollar Tree very inexpensive obviously uh, I think I got a couple packs for a couple dollars and uh, I put a four leaf clover in the center to give it that pop of green and then I've got this gold silverware in the middle. And you guys have seen that silverware before. That's the silverware that I purchased from Walmart <clears throat> very inexpensively. Um, now, for the napkins, I have just plain white linen napkins and some uh, napkin rings that you've seen before. I got those uh, at Pier 1. And um, also, I have a gold... If you can see it, I have a gold runner on the table that I got from, and you pro you've probably seen this uh, in another tablescape. But anyway, I got that from, um, I think it was Ross. Now, the glassware, I don't know if you can tell uh, on camera, but the glassware is green uh, with a clear stem, and I got these at Dollar Tree. The... Um, Let's see what else we can see here. You'll see I've got some gold coins. I've got my four-leaf clovers scattered all over the table. Now, for the centerpiece, since we were, part of the challenge was to incorporate uh, food, um, green food, into the tablescape. 
I just decided to make that uh, the food my centerpiece. My table's not that big, so I thought, you know what? I think this will work. So what I did is um, I put a green napkin on the table to get that pop of green. And it's a napkin. I, I, I already had those napkins. Um, and then I put a mirror that I already had. I picked up this mirror some time ago from Joanne Fabric. And I used a cake plate that I already had. Um, and I'll get a little close. Uh, it is white. And it's got a little gold um, sort of pattern in it. And I've used this before. I think it was the Valentine's Coffee Bar, Coffee Station. I used uh, this cake plate in that um, video. So below, I just put a few four-leaf clovers on the mirror. And uh, I've got some votives down there with the little battery-powered uh, votives inside. And um, these candle holders, um, I picked those up some time ago. Uh, they were on sale at uh, Home Goods, I believe. And inside, I just have a little battery-powered votive, uh, or rather, a battery-powered candle. So that's really it, guys. Um, I had these white pillows in my chair, my chairs already, so I just left them there. They're pillows that I had brought in from the living room, and, uh, I've just left them in the chairs because I like the way they look. And, um, that's all I got. So, um, please let me know. You know, you guys know I welcome all of your comments. Let me know if you like what I did or if you think I need to do something different. Um, I'd like to hear about it, and I want to make sure that I mention our host again. Uh, again, her channel is, if it ain't cheap, I'm not buying it. If you're not subscribing to her channel, I'm telling you, you are missing some great content. Uh, again, the hashtag is the luck of the Irish 20, and uh, I'm going to have all of the information in the description box. And as soon as it's available, I will also go ahead and link the uh, playlist so that you can find all of the other uh, uh, creators and, and, you know, what they came up with. I'm telling you, we've got a lot of talent out here. And uh, I've been so amazed with some of the things that some of the creators come up with, especially for these tablescape videos. So anyway, that's all I had, guys. I'll shut up now. And uh, let you look at the tablescape for a minute or two. I'll put on some music. And uh, listen, thank you so much for watching. And if you have not subscribed to this channel, I hope you do that. Hit the notifications button. And uh, then, of course, we're going to see you in the next video. Bye-bye.